Hey, you look like you're really sweet. Or a massive troublemaker. Nah, I'm just sweet, lol. Good answer, winky face. What's something you've done before that you'll never do again? Reply to your messages. Nah, I'm just sweet. <laughs> okay, whatever you say. Hey everyone, my name is Jake and welcome to r slash Tinder, where people share their craziest and funniest Tinder experiences. Rachel, 23. I mean, the picture's funny, but what is that TV doing? Look at the stand that it's on, that's just gonna fall over and hurt someone. Are you a bot or real? You're almost too pretty. Um, Would a bot send you that? I mean, a bot probably wouldn't send that, but a catfish definitely would. Roses are red, violets are blue. I don't smoke crack, but sometimes I do. Roses are red. I can't tell if that's a joke. I'll roll you a blunt, as I don't have the budget for coke. Roses are red. It was really a joke. I'll take the Smirnoff. You can do the coke. Roses are red. I've only done coke twice. Smirnoff is icky, but how about a Ciroc ice? Roses are red, this is quite the task. Should we end the rhyme? I thought I'd ask. Roses are red, you can quit if you'd like to, for I have this motto, I won't finish before you do. I mean, the only one I'm good at is, roses are dead, violets are dead, I'm shit at gardening. Haven't we matched before? Yeah, we did. Why did we unmatch? We went on a date. Ugh. It couldn't have been that bad if they rematched, so you know. Press his nurse call button. Sexy nurse voice. Can I help you? I pooped my pants again. I need you to change them and the sheets immediately. God damn it. Now this is how to roleplay a nurse realistically. If you were a sandwich, which kind of sandwich would you be and why? A PB&J on generic white bread because you'll only resort to me out of pure desperation. Thank you for having an actually interesting slash funny response. But what happens when PB&J is my go-to instead of my backup? Well, it's your lucky day, because I'm about to be sticking to the roof of your mouth. Um, sometimes you need to sacrifice yourself for the punchline, I guess. Are you a real person or a catfish? Lamau, real, WTF? You're very pretty, so I have to assume the worst. Oh, ha ha ha. Well, to be honest, this account is mine, but I'm trying to help one of my best friends who's still in high school because basically she broke up with her boyfriend today and her prom is Saturday, so she needs someone to take her and she wants to make his jealous, Lamau. Would you be down? Her Insta is at blank. Oh. I see that you're an actor, so this is perfect for you. I know you'll get something in return. This was a very roundabout way of saying you're a catfish. This reminds me of that one Rick and Morty episode when he has the micro universes and Rick explains to Morty how it works and he's like, oh, that just sounds like slavery with extra steps because that sounds like catfishing with extra steps. Hey sexy, I'm horny. So when do you want to smash? When works for you? Hmm, let me ask my mum. She just comes back with, Ah, oh, damn, sorry, my mum says I've got to clean my room first. Hey, sexy. Hey, how are you? <laughs> really horny, lol. How about you? Haha, <laughs> I'm good, just relaxing in a hot tub right now. Dang, really? That's hot. Still not sure if you're a bot or not. Say watermelon for me, haha. <laughs> Watermelon, lol. All right, I'm convinced. <laughs> There's gonna be one day where we're gonna actually need to send like capture codes or like face recognition in order to just make sure someone's not catfishing. Thank you, thank you. Now, let's get down to brass tacks. Where's the best place to hide a body? No, no, no. You murder and hide at the same time. Go hiking and push them off a cliff slash mountain. Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. Next topic, date ideas. I was thinking we could go hiking. Wonderful idea. Let's see who makes it back. Whoa, 
I think I just fell in love. <laughs> well, they're either gonna fall in love or off a cliff at this point. If we get married and you live longer than me, I want you to have me cremated. Then mix my ashes with chili powder and eat. All so I can tear that ass up one last time. When I die, I want that joke to be buried with me so that no one has to hear it ever again. <laughs> I mean, you gotta give him an A for effort. Perfect way to take your ex out of a picture. I just love how he's a graphic designer. Just snap of the fingers, reality can be whatever I want it to be. Just dropped a hot new single. It's me, I'm now single. Thank you my ex for ghosting me. I'm legally deaf, it's not a joke. You sure he was ghosting you? You just might not have heard him. Sorry if that's too soon, it was just too good of an opportunity. Ha, huh, yeah I bet she's never heard that one before. Prepare yourself. Do you know what's the similarity between me and your exams? What? They're both hard. And they'll pass quickly. But you gotta take it first. Ugh, ah, if I had to rate your game, mm, it's gonna have to be a yikes from me. This a dude using the girl filter. Seventh person in 147. This is for a research for UT sociology final. Bro, you could still get it. Still get what? Hmm. Very bold of you. <laughs> Can you guys remember when sociology used to involve in-depth experiments on like huge groups of people? Well, we've come so far. Haha, <laughs> thanks. How's your day been? <laughs> Bored. Spent the day petting my pussy. You're petting your cat? Mmm, it's so wet. Did your cat fall into water? I'm fondling myself. I'm playing with my vagina. So, you're telling me there's no cat? God, this guy's trying to come onto Tinder to see some pictures of some cats, and this Ah, it's just disgusting nowadays. That's right, master of seduction over here. Whisper things in your ear like, I did the laundry. Bathroom is clean. Dishes are done. Mmm. Jesus Christ, I'm getting wet. Goddamn right you are. I know what you want. Hoo hoo, this one shouldn't be read without adult supervision. Did it hurt when you fell from the vending machine? Not because you're a snack, but because you look like the type of girl who'll do anything for £1.25. Not wrong. £1.25 from something from the vending machine. Blah, I wouldn't pay more than a pound for anything in there. Do you smoke crack? Because I'd give you the pipe. I'm gonna give you one redo on first impression if you want. Do you do heroin? Because I wouldn't mind shooting inside of you. Do you smoke pot? Because weed might be cute together. They really need to make a joke about a pickup line for their next joke. Ha, ha, ah. You matched with Chu Ling. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Lamau, just in London at the moment. What about you? Not much. I'm just chilling. Wow, okay, you just did that. I mean, yeah, she's probably heard it a lot of times, but why did she put Lamau when he said, hey, what's up? What? What would you like? Number one. Bad pickup line. Number two, question. Number three, roast. Or four, you ask me. I haven't been roasted. Go for it. Alright. If your ass was any flatter, conspiracy theorists all over the world would use you as living proof. Dwar. She asked for it, but jeez, dude. Brad, 22. Hi guys, I am actually 11 years old, but I need a girlfriend that can be in my Minecraft Let's Play vids so I can use you for clickbait and get more views. Thanks! Amongst us is a god there is. This kid is gonna be the next PewDiePie, just I'm telling you right now. You have the most beautiful eyes. Thanks! So, what's up, cutie? Talking to this really cool dude. Really? Would I know him? Haha! <laughs> Yeah, I'm going on a date with him tomorrow night after I get off work. Oh, no, you don't know him. Mmm, just, just F, just F's in the chat for that guy. Hey everyone, that does it for this episode of r slash Tinder. If you enjoyed that video, then please do leave a like on it and subscribe if you aren't already. If you want to see some other videos, then click on screen right now. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you very soon.
Oh, and if you want to check out my Instagram, my Twitter, and my Discord, it's top link in the description.